On a crisp October morning, running enthusiast Bob Wagner sets out on his daily run. Uh, when I was in seventh grade, I read a book about uh, Glenn Cunningham, and Glenn was burnt severely, and they said he'd never walk again. Well, he ended up running a 403 mile. He ran everywhere he went, and it kind of inspired me to kind of do the same thing. I met Roy Griak, the famous coach. I used to babysit his two boys, Seth and Jason, and he told me, uh, Bob, why don't you run a thousand miles this summer, which I thought was nuts, you know. But I didn't run a thousand, I ran 987 miles that summer. Those 987 miles led to countless more, including record-breaking runs, international success, and a passion that will last a lifetime. I was state champion at St. Louis Park uh, six times, so I got a full ride at the U of M, which was pretty nice. And then in track, I set a 21-year-old state record in the, half, in the half mile back then. It was like 880. And then I got into the Olympic trials a couple of times in the marathon, and uh, I was in the service for three years, and I was on uh, German sports clubs, and I was a uh, Berlin champion a couple of times, and raced in different places in Germany. Over the course of his 73 years, Bob has ran over 228,000 miles, which is equivalent to running around the equator nine times. He shows no signs of stopping and inspires those around him every single day. I'm used to his, his, his passion and his drive to, to be uh, in shape, and it certainly improved my physique over the years. I've been running almost 60 years, and, uh, but the last, I'd say, 40 has just been in the woods on trails. I'm not out there just jogging, you know. I'm, I'm training pretty intensely, and uh, the harder you work, the better you're going to perform. Even all these surgeries I've had, I still get out and go do it. 